Hi right, guys, second video for the day. What's my video for the day? What's going on in uh, this is the last time I'm gonna talk about you know uh, this is the last time I'm gonna talk about you know what's going on in Israel because it's a very controversial controversial uh, you know uh, topic. But I'm gonna just know what's going on right now. How come like that you know uh, you see people uh, in around the cities that in around the colleges they're uh, pro Hamas or pro Palestine? Why? Before that, that used to be, you know, we, you know, we side with uh, Israel. Well, here's what happened. People are tired of war, okay? And, uh, you know, Israel got attacked, okay? But the problem is this. The response to that was kind of like heavy-handed, okay? Very, very heavy-handed. This is what they did. They uh, invaded Gaza, okay? And turn the war zone. Okay, that's their call. I can't, you know, I can't say anything about that. But in the recent two, in the last two, three weeks of that, a hospital was blown up. I don't know who did it, but it might be, it might be the ro rocket from 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 uh, from, uh, from, uh, from, uh, from Gaza or maybe a J dam. But when those people that you see that that's suffering, they were, you know, when the thing came down like that. Okay, people were like crying, oh my gosh, look at this, you know, you know, it's all in the world that disparity of response, okay? Okay. They, uh, you know, they, uh, you know, Hamas killed 1,400 people. But, look at that count right now in Palestine, 10,000. Imagine that, okay? The disparity to that. That's what people are calling for ceasefire because, you know, we need to sort these things out. You see, that's, you know, uh, this was an embarrassment for that, you know, the Bibi, Nathan Hayu. You know why? He was asleep in the wheel. Okay? And he shows, you, uh, shows us that, that, you know, uh, he doesn't know what he's doing. Okay? He's got to almost got the civil war. You know, they got attacked. And, from, and there was this document that was leaked out about, uh, check out on TikTok. You know, uh, you know uh, or we research about the Ben Gurion Canal that runs through Gaza. Oh gosh, that was a that was a kicker. You know when I when I read read about that, imagine that. Okay, that's why like that you know uh, you know you know you know Israel is losing the press battle because you can say about you know anti-Semitism things like that, but that's an old argument already. People are getting wise about that argument. They said okay, okay, they see what's happening in Gaza. Seeing what happened, you know, in, in, in Tel Aviv, Tel Aviv right now, you know, it's a party place. Everybody's enjoying their time. If you look at, you know, if you look at Jerusalem, okay, it looks good. People are doing their thing. That's normal. Even though they're under attack, but look at Gaza. Every day is hell, and the people are seeing that. See, our media here in America like that is run by. It's more slanted to the to the Jewish the Jewish side. In Europe, like that, they're more critical. That's why like that, you know, uh, and, and also the internet, okay? And it's wrong to tear down posters of, of people getting kidnapped. That is wrong. Leave it alone. You know, I say stay neutral. That's not your argument, okay? And, uh, you know, uh, and this thing going on in the college, poor, poor, poor college students, you know, you've been manipulated. If I were you guys, that go study, get a degree. And then it's just another one of those things that these people have no purpose. Okay, instead of you know uh, finding ways to improve your country, stop you know uh, you know stop doing this. Go to school, you know, uh, improve your life and contribute to the community. You can change your community to that just by uh, contributing to it. Okay, be a coach, volunteer. Instead of doing this, they're like, oh, storm the White House. Well, here's the, here's, the, here's the thing. Joe ain't there. Sorry to tell you guys, he's traveling. You know, not, the president doesn't stay you know, in the place all the time. He has to. He has to do some things. He's called. That's why he's called president, presiding over the nation. So that's the thing. And if I you know, uh, if I foresee fire, you know, yes, because you know why? I don't want to be any more people getting killed. But this is gonna be. You know, this is a cluster fuck like that that happened before. That's you know what? Uh, that's gonna be untangled. You know, it's a good thing right now. Hezbollah. It's not gonna. You know, it's not, it's not, they're not gonna go into war. And are they pussies? No. Most of them are saying, you know what? They're comfortable. They have money coming in. If they go to war, they lose. They lose their funding. 
better be safe for that. So, and, you know, it was a, even I was just saying, oh, we're gonna go to war, organize. I think it's just this all paper things. They're just saying this blah 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 blah. But don't do it. It's only support. Okay. Look at Egypt. They have the best army in the world. They have one of the best armies in the world. Also, I did, what are they doing? They're sitting on their, on their hands. They're not doing anything. So let's, I, know, let's, I say, let, let's play out. And there's no such thing as the return of the rapture. This, this is going to come. You know what? They promised the Messiah to come all these years. He hasn't come. If he does come like that, he's not going to be coming like in a big ball of light, landing in a red carpet. It's not going to happen. You know, Jesus came to this world like that, you know, or any other Messiah like that. You know, they just walked in the capital riding a donkey or being a normal person. See what I mean? You know, uh, this is the thing, okay? As I'm watching, the news are slanted, so always try and, and, and don't watch as much as can, much, much of it, because you know, it's all, most of it's bullshit, and B, it's bad for your health. Because you know why, you know, it be, I'm curious because you know what, I'm a historian, but nevertheless, it drains too much of your positive energy. So hopefully they decide to stop, to stop the madness, and uh, we can stop and talk it out. And let's go back into uh, you know their old lives.